Hello my lovelies! In my last vlog of December with Tamara I asked you whether you wanted to see what I received for Christmas and I received a lot of comments both on my Instagram and on the YouTube under that video saying that you guys would really like to see what I received and that you wanted me kind of to show you what are the bits and bobs that I got for Christmas so I'm not gonna make a disclaimer because many of you actually commented on my last video you said that you don't think I'm bragging and that you understand the nature of this video so basically this video is not about bragging. Like I mentioned before, for Christmas I prefer giving than getting, so I did not actually expect any of the amazing stuff that I received, but I'm entirely grateful for every single item that I got. I'm gonna start showing you in no particular order, I'm just gonna grab them all around me. Uh, some of the stuff I got from like family and friends and some of the stuff I received from the brands, which I will outline. When it comes to family and friends, I'm not gonna kind of like go and say like, this is what I got from this person and this is what I got from that person, because I think that is kind of weird and I don't want to do that so I'll just kind of tell you which are the gifts that I received from, from brands because I think that would be fair. I'm gonna start with books. Um, these two books I received for Christmas. Uh, first one was Lindsay Kelk, A Girl's Best Friend. Now I love Lindsay Kelk if you guys know I've read all of her uh, all of her books. You guys probably know that because you've seen on my Instagram. Actually I think every Christmas I receive a book from her more or less and also Sophie Kinsella which is my other kind of like chick flick favorite author and this is Shopaholic to the Rescue. The book is kind of like written while she's kind of doing everything in Vegas which I think is going to be super exciting to read because I visited Las Vegas for the first time this year so I can't wait to read this because in January actually I will be traveling for a holiday and I think this will be perfect beach read. Next is this super fluffy cushion for my bed. You guys might not know, but I got a new bed in my bedroom, which I will show you when I do like a little bedroom tour. And this cushion is gonna come in perfectly um, to sort of decorate it because my bed is sort of like light gray color. So I think this just fits perfect. On the other side is just like really uh, clean and soft. And here is like hairy and fluffy and fuzzy and it's so comfy. So kind of like just cuddle up with a cup of tea and some movies. Or Good Wife. I'm watching Good Wife at the moment. So if you're into TV shows, go and check out Good Wife. I love it. Then I got something that I absolutely love. And this is like a little bag filled with like lavender grains. Like little grains which are scented with lavender. And it smells so fresh and so beautiful. I will be putting this in my wardrobe to kind of keep my clothes, not like one of these open wardrobes, in one of the closed wardrobes, to keep my clothes really fresh and nice smelling. Probably, I'll put it probably in my wardrobe where I keep like all the like socks and um, gym gear and house clothes because I have a separate wardrobe for those. And this is just gonna keep it all like fresh and beautiful. So I love this. And then I got a bunch of hair ties because this is kind of like a joke. Uh, these are from Clara's accessories and are the only one that can support my hair. My sister always says that I never have a hair tie, that I always lose them. And actually I was late to gym one day because I couldn't find one. And I can't be doing gym with this hair like going everywhere and stuff, especially when it's frizzy. It's so annoying. So got a bunch of hair ties. I got one more. I don't know where that one is. But yeah, so this is a very useful gift. Now, next present was a huge surprise for me because I did not expect that at all. And this is going to be the only gift that I tell you kind of like who is it from because I think it's funny. One day I got home and I received this like really heavy package and I thought like it was just something from a brand because it was really heavy so I was like what could this be like that heavy and I really struggled opening it first of all because it was like sellotaped all around and then I opened it and there was this like little hamper inside like a little basket and I thought like oh that's cute it must be like some cheese and wine and things like that chocolates and then I open and there's a card um, which is not here with me right now because I put it in on my cards um, cabinet but basically it started saying Binny and only one person in this world called me that way and that's my friend Sandra who's also a blogger from 5 Inch and Up and I was like like what? I did not expect this at all so I received a box full of chocolates which is what you can see here um, these are like special finished chocolates because obviously she's finished and these are delicious like I already tried this one which is like a chili chili dark chocolate but also she sent me my favorites because she knows these are my favorites and these are the Fatser 
geisha chocolates. So these are all Fatsur chocolates, which are like Finnish brand of chocolates um, that kind of she has ties, family ties too. So um, I received like a full basket of chocolates that I got so excited for because I love eating these chocolates whenever I'm at her home. But like seriously, the heavy part of it is what you're probably wondering, like what was so heavy in it, is a candle I received. And I'm obsessed with candles, you probably know that, and I could never have enough. But I receive a huge Roja candle from um, that smells like tuberous, and it's a four wick candle, which as you can see, it's like a huge candle. So it's a huge tuberous four wick candle. I mean, I. I think she's crazy for getting me something like this because, I don't know, like I just did not expect it. I'm so grateful for it. It made me so emotional and I had to text her the following day. I was like, oh my god, I can't believe this. And the card was really sweet as well. I had to mention that because I feel so grateful. It's just wonderful. I think my computer just went off, but that doesn't matter. Um, so yeah, thanks to Sandra for just surprising me so much this Christmas. Talking about chocolates, I also got a box of chocolates which, uh, which say... Happy New Year! This I actually got from a brand from Pronovias because I am one of their It Brides for UK for 2015. So I did a collaboration with them and they sent me a box of chocolates which I haven't opened yet because I have so many chocolates um, and I just simply obviously like didn't get around opening it thanks to those guys for sending me this wonderful gift. Then something that I actually asked for are these cozy comfy boot slippers. If you watched my morning routine video you probably know that I had something very similar to this but because you know like you wash them and then they lost, lose the shape and things like that so I asked for the new ones and these are super 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 cozy and soft and I'm actually gonna put them on now because I show them to you right now so slippers are something that I really wanted for Christmas so I'm super happy that I got them. I also asked for pajamas and I did get them but they're actually in washing now so sadly I can't show you. I received another candle. This one says it's a fragrance free candle but actually it smells wonderful kind of like a vanilla. I love this candle. It is like really long and beautiful and sleek and it goes beautiful with my bed because actually my bedroom because my bed is kind of like this color so uh, a bit lighter so I think it goes beautifully with my bedroom and I can't wait to burn it because I've never had such a tall candle I think it's gonna look beautiful if I, if I put it on like a silver plate or a golden plate I'll see what goes with my with accessories of my bedroom so I'm very 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 excited for this I could never have enough candles I think I'm a bit candle obsessed and lip balm obsessed that's like the two things and planner obsessed like there are three things that I can never buy enough then a pair of shoes that I absolutely love. I received these from Nicholas Kirkwood and um, as you guys know I love Nicholas Kirkwood shoes. They come in a beautiful box so here they are and I think the shoes are just really really lovely. And this is what they look like. They're sort of like lace up, lace and beautiful heels. They tie up at the front, they're like navy and orange, like coral color. I don't have the name of the model, but I'll try and make, I will try and find um, this particular model and link it below if I can find it. I really like them, I think they'll be beautiful for sort of like spring and summer and can't wait to wear them. So this is it, thanks to Nicholas Kirkwood. Only a few more things left. Uh, from Emu, which is another brand that I collaborated with this year, I received these leather gloves with a bit of a fur here and they're very warm. They're actually all fur lined inside so you can imagine how warm they are. Just wonderful and grey colour is my favourite so I think these will come in very handy in January and February when I go fashion week because that's a very very cold time of the year. And then from wonderful people at Dior Beauty I received something that I haven't even had a chance to open yet so I thought I might actually do that on camera. I've got a this Dior palette which is sort of like their Christmas uh, couture holiday collection and a set of brushes so I'm sure a lot of you would like to see me open it. So the set of brushes, I love your brushes, I actually have a few already, Ooh, something just fell out, come in this beautiful case, it says Dior here and it's like a varnish finish, like a glossy finish, and then, oh this is actually going to be really nice for traveling as well, and then the brushes are in here, 
and I really 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 like them. There's something sort of like a powder brush, foundation brush and few eye like eyeshadow brushes. So this is gonna be fantastic when traveling. I really love their brushes because they don't mold and they're really good. And then the the Dior Holiday Couture Collection palette. It's for eyes, lips, everything. Let's see what this looks like. Ooh, wow. I would actually love to have a wallet that looks like this. Um, it's beautiful. Like a beautiful leather, beautiful Christian Dior logo. And it opens with like a zippy thing. Oh my god, this is gorgeous. Wow. Sorry, but like the reaction, like I don't even know how am I going to be able to show you this. This is just insanely beautiful with some pink purpley, like a golden and grey tones and black smoky and a blush, illuminator, lip glosses. This is just gorgeous. I'm going to have to show you a close up of this because you have to see it has a big mirror on top of that and it's just insanely beautiful like honestly so cute this is like a perfect travel companion as well so love that ladies at Lancome were very kind to send me Levia's Belle I think that's how you pronounce it again my French is horrible this is the intense perfume and it smells divine it's one of my current favorite perfumes actually and I am um, I just don't remember falling in love with the scent that much um, so I was very excited when I received this in the post and I also received a little candle and a sample which are somewhere around my house so I just love this and I think it's beautiful thanks so much to the ladies at Lancome because I just love this scent one that you've seen in I think my last vlog is this little pouch from the Kenzo girls I love it so it's like um something that you can put on your shoulder when you're traveling and put your phone in it, your cards, anything you need really because it's quite actually stretchy and it's this like purple, iridescent purple color Kenzo pouch with a detachable shoulder strap so I think this is just perfect for someone like me and also something that you haven't seen yet that I also received from girls at Kenzo is my ultimate uh, Christmas jumper so this is it. It's actually embellished. It has like a silver beads here and here. It's beautiful material. It's it's a knit, but it's like some amazing knit. Let's see what it is. It's wool and stretch. So basically it's just ideal because it won't get those bobbly things on your sleeves and stuff. I just love Kenzo tops. They're amazing. But this is like the ultimate Christmas jumper. Another thing that you've seen in my vlog, so I'm not gonna go long about it, it's this wood sage and sea salt collection from Jo Malone. I received this from Jo Malone Girls and it is a, what is this, body cream, cologne and body and hand wash. I love the scent, it's beautiful, it's very fresh. This is another perfect travel set so very grateful for that. Then Girls at Kiehl's sent me like my winter kit and there's one thing missing in here and that would be the face wash because it's in my shower right now. I love that face wash. So I've got the Midnight Recovery Concentrate, the Creamy Eye Treatment, the Ultra Facial Cream and my favorite, all time favorite Kiehl's product, this Creme de Corpse, which is like also the best moisturizer in the whole entire world so I'm so happy that I got it. Um, so yeah, this is also very, very handy. And then something that I got from girls at Benefit is this wonderful, wonderful, what do you call this, makeup bag? When I was in Düsseldorf, I got this from Benefit Girls from the German team. So uh, thanks to the girls at Benefit Germany. They literally asked me that I like what I, what what are my favorite products and said that I could have every favorite product of mine. But first of all, I have to show you this pouch. Like now, this is insanely amazing. It's like a folder, like a book folder inside. Can you see? So you can put all of your products in there. And I picked my favorites, which are well, this one's not in here because I used it this morning to do my makeup. And it is the Benefit Roller Lash. It's like the best mascara. I love it, love it, love it, love it. Then I decided to take Hula Bronzer because you can never have enough Hula. I love Hula Bronzer. Uh, also, What's Up is an amazing highlighter in a stick. I'll show you. If you're not familiar with it, this is what it looks like. 
has like a little bulb and it has a sponge here at the bottom so you can sort of blend it in and then a stick here at the top which leaves like beautiful iridescent silvery golden shimmers something like that but not glitter shimmer so that's called what's up then professional which i love using for like below my foundation or sometimes i even mix it with the foundation then 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 this which i've only tried so far twice i didn't want to take it out of the box before i show you but it is air patrol and what is this this is a eyelid bb cream great primer which makes the eyeshadow much more intense and stay on longer on your eyelid something that i actually run out of and a product that I love from Benefit is the Fake Up, and mine is in color 1 light. It's kind of like this white, I'm not sure if you can see, like it looks like a white lip balm. In the center it has like a concealer thing, so it moisturizes your eye area and like uh, makes it more luminous. And I also got the Their Real Push Up Liner, so the eyeliner, which is also great. I just love this makeup bag. I'm obsessed with it. It's so amazingly designed and I'm very, very grateful to the girls at German Benefit. They're so sweet and so lovely. So huge thanks to them for giving me this wonderful gift. And now the moment that you all were waiting for, I'm going to make a big Chanel reveal. This is something that, again, I did not expect something that I'm very 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 excited to show you and something that I guess many of you couldn't wait to see what's in um, I'm super grateful for this gift this is something that I never expected and I absolutely love what's in there so I'm gonna show you so the first is the smaller box the one that you all wanted to see uh, when I showed it in the vlog I was super curious what could be inside most of you were like saying it's a watch or a piece of jewelry, or someone even said a belt. And now I'm gonna show you what's in there. Not yet, oops, there you go. So when you open it, it comes in with a pouch. And then, it's a wonderful bracelet. And I'm gonna have to zoom in on this one to show you the pearls, because it's pearl embellished in the front here. And it just looks so beautiful. I already wore it yesterday. It looks really lovely on my wrist, I think, at least. I already wore it on the Christmas day and I just love it so, so, so much. So that's that. And then, guys, there is a big box which has a camellia here. This was all wrapped so beautifully and, I mean, I can't even deal how excited I am to show you. I'm actually wearing today the last year's Christmas gift, so I don't know if you watched my what I got for Christmas, but here's the Chanel pearl necklace that I wore actually quite a lot this year. So, when you open it, there was a camellia stuck here, a lot of tissue paper. Oh my god, this is, this is so exciting for me. Ta-da! Okay. So it comes in this white um, dust bag. You can see it's green. I'm so excited. And there we go. It is a double flap classic Chanel bag in green. Caviar, leather, I am literally dying over this bag. It's like literally the most perfect Chanel bag I've seen lately. So it opens here and then there's the double flap. There's a pocket at the back there, a one here, a zippy one. Then a pocket at the front here, a tiny one. And two pockets back there with the Chanel logo. Oh, I just can't stop looking at it. So here it is. It's so wonderful. It smells like new leather. It's beautiful. It has that back pocket here and I really like it. I also really like that it's so like, it has this kind of like silver but dark silver, like almost black um, hardware because I think it's very understated and not too flashy or too tacky. I just love it. I think it's beautiful and I'm entirely grateful for this gift. I can't wait to show you how I style it and I can't wait to wear it. And I always wanted like a classic bag like this. And that is it guys. I'm pretty sure I forgot something which is super irresponsible and annoying but 
that's life. Um, I'm so 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 grateful, so thanks to every single person that got me something and even to people who didn't get me anything but were just here to share the moments with me. I'm so grateful for that and thank you all for watching this video. Make sure to subscribe if you want to see more. I will be filming more videos this year so there'll be something more to see. I'll see you soon! Bye!